Okay, students. So in this question, the diagram shows the path of a particle in a region of uniform magnetic field. The field is directed into the plane of page as it is shown, because this cross means that the magnetic field is into the page. And if there is a dot here, this means that the magnetic field is coming out of the plane. Okay, so the magnetic field is into the board now. And the trajectory that is followed by a particle is also shown here. This particle could be the alpha particle, beta particle, a photon or a neutron. So let us first discuss about these particles like alpha particle. What is alpha particle? Alpha particle is basically a helium nucleus from which two electrons have been removed. And so we are left with the nucleus of helium. So that is known as alpha particle. So this is uh, positively charged because there are no electrons now and beta particle is essentially an electron. So we can say that it is negatively charged. Photon is neutral and neutron is also neutral. So this is a positively charged particle. This is negatively charged particle and these two are uh, neutral. So no force will be acting on the neutral. So definitely it is neither C nor D. They are out of the scene now. So now as we have been discussing in the earlier videos also that instead of uh, Fleming's uh, right hand rule or left hand rule, I prefer to use right hand palm rule. So this is right hand palm rule in front of you. And uh, it is of three types, type one, type two, type three. It is based on uh, how, what are the things that we, are, we need to find. So it is the type two in which uh, uh, we use to find the direction of the force on the charged particle in the magnetic field. So we would be using the type 2 now, not the type 1, not the type 3, and we will not be discussing them now. So according to type 2, um, what, what we do is we use our right hand now and we point our fingers towards the magnetic field. So I am pointing finger towards you, that is like towards my laptop screen because the magnetic field is going into the laptop screen. So there we go. These are my fingers pointing towards you and the velocity of the particle is depicted by my thumb and it is going towards the right hand side. So I will keep my palm like this. Okay. I keep my palm like this. Fingers are pointing towards the magnetic field and my thumb is pointing towards the direction of the positive charge. And so my palm is pointing towards the direction of the force. Okay. So now it is given that it is having force in upward direction and that is why the trajectory is moving in upward direction. Okay, so it means that we must keep our hand like this because the force is in the upward direction towards the palm. And it means the positive charge should be moving with this velocity vector. So this velocity vector is moving like this. So it means we must be definitely talking about the positive charge. So I think this should be the correct answer. So let us see from the mark scheme and absolutely correct. It is a positive charge. So alpha, okay, it can be alpha particle. I hope this is very clear to you now. If there's any problem to you, please do comment. All the best. Bye.